make sure you're using the latest or one of the latest versions of RPCS3. Then go to configuration, gear, and here in the pad input section, turn on enable pad navigation, apply. And now you're able to control RPCS3 or the mouse cursor in RPCS3 with your with your game pad or controller. But if you click outside of the RPCS3 window, you lose the ability to control with the gamepad. If you go back to the pad input section and turn on allow global pad navigation, you'll be able to control even when the RPCS3 window is not focused or even when it's minimized. You can see more about this in a RPCS3 Twitter post and what the controllers or what the buttons of the controllers do. And then when you close RPCS3, you'll lose the ability to control with the gamepad or to control the mouse cursor with the gamepad.